hey y'all welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a quick little birthday shop with me i was able to get out the house and go shopping and it felt good since i didn't get to go shopping on my actual birthday um my mom was supposed to watch girls for me that day and i was supposed to head down to myrtle beach which is not far at all and i was supposed to have a shopping trip slash girls day with my sister-in-law but my mom ended up getting sick so that didn't happen so here i am a few days later um i'm just treating myself today So both Livia and Cadence was with me on this day. Addison and Maya was in school. Cadence is home because someone in her grade level had tested positive for COVID. And protocol with their school is if a child tests positive for COVID, then they send that whole grade level home for two weeks. Um, and the school nurse would have called me had she been exposed or close to the child that had tested positive. But thank God she wasn't. So it's a virtual learning for the next two weeks for her. So I bought this from Michael's to put all my baking supplies in it. Um, the one you just seen in my car was for my mother-in-law. She had me pick it up for. Here's just a quick overview of everything I picked up. So this is everything that I got yesterday. While I was out shopping. Um, you probably notice there's no clothes. I'm really not big on clothes shopping. I rather buy home decor, um, which I probably should buy clothes because I'm running out of room for home decor stuff. But um, I wanted to get a bunch of Valentine's Day stuff for my Valentine's boxes that I plan on doing. But let me show y'all everything I got right now. So starting right here, I got this dry erase board. Um, I think it comes from Home Goods. It's on clearance. Nope, TJ Maxx. Three dollars. Dry erase board with the marker and it's got like a little magnet. Also TJ Maxx. All their makeup and stuff was on clearance. Four dollars. You see the regular press. Eight dollars for these. I, started, I got a lot of makeup. This Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick. This was $3 regular price. I guess it said $6.99. Melania. Y'all, I, I love this brand. A dollar. I mean, it's only $3. A dollar's better, right? Um, also picked this up. A lip kit. And it was a dollar as well. Um, I thought I had another pack of lashes from them. I guess not. Um, moving on. I ordered these lashes off of a web, well, Instagram. Actually, I seen it girl on TikTok, and I was like, I love your lashes. And I ordered some for myself. I paid $30 for four pair of eyelashes, y'all. Like, if you know me, you know I love my lashes and baking, like... I love my eyelashes, but I got those. I got this from Hobby Lobby. It's just um, a little mold. You can put um, candy, well, you can make candy or your chocolate milk in it, $3.99. How cute is this little cake tray, y'all? 
Like, I'm starting to become obsessed between cake trays and sprinkles. But this one's so cute and I love this blue. It was only $5.99. I found this at Burke's. Um, I had to get some sprinkles for my Valentine's Day orders. These were expensive at Michael's for $9.99. I usually never get stuff like this from Michael's, but it's Valentine's Day and kind of wanted them. So, I got them. This come from Hobby Lobby. Um, I had to pick it up. My grandpa, I'll never forget it. He used to say, hey, good looking what you got cooking. So this just reminded me of him. I'm probably going to keep it up in my kitchen year round. But you see it says, let's get cooking good looking. Like I said, that come from Hobby Lobby and it was $5.99. Also Hobby Lobby for my cake pops, I got this little mold. There's a heart shape mold right here, um, a star mold and a flower mold. It was $6.99. these cute little rolling pins for my tear tray I told y'all in my last video that i was going to redecorate my tear tray between now and valentine's day but these were 3.99 a piece i thought these are going there i got this huge pantry sign hobby lobby had their signs well wild decor 50 percent off um it was right there 20 dollars so pay 10 dollars for it um i plan on my next video is going to be a pantry video slash how you turn a bookshelf into a pantry. So make sure y'all stay tuned and you you have your bell notifications turned on so you'll see that. I'm excited about that. Um, I got this from Hobby Lobby, little sign. Y'all know how crazy it was with cocoa bombs with me for Christmas. So I've decided I'm going to sell them year round. Well, just for the winter months and I plan on doing them for Valentine's Day. So I just thought this was really fitting. All you need is love and hot cocoa. And I love it. It was, Valentine's Day is not on sale yet. I think it's going on sale next week, but this was $13.99. I think, no, I didn't get to use the 40% off coupon on that. I did use the 40% off coupon on this though. I got two yards of this um, Buffalo plaid fabric. I plan on making some curtains out of it. Once again, it's going to go with this pantry theme that I'm going to do out of a bookshelf. So, like I said, make sure you got your notifications turned on so y'all get notified when this goes up. I got these molds for Valentine's Day order and actually just to have. I don't know how I'm going to like them because I usually like the um, silicone molds like these. These are plastic, so I don't know how that's going to work out. They were $1.99, Hobby Lobby. Oh, I love this right here. Another cake stand. This one come from Home Goods. It was $9.99. How cute is that, y'all? Hold on, I was starting to get obsessed with cake stands. I love it. I picked up these molds from um, Home Goods. They were with the tray. They were $3.99 for these in their silicone, which would be easier to put my chocolate in and literally pops right out. Or you can bake. I can bake some like mini cakes in these, which I may try that. My sister-in-law happened to go to Home Goods yesterday after she got off of work and she picked this up for me. So I got two of them, different sizes though. It was $3.99. Also from Hobby Lobby, they had their candles 50% off. These were $12.99, 12, 12 so it was like, what, $6.50. I got Uplift and Refresh. Uplift is, I'm not even going to try it, Ber Bergamot and Lemon Peel. I don't know. <laughs> and Refresh, number five, is Rose and Grapefruit. This one smells so good. This one has like a coffee scent to it. Um... And I got this. I have a like a big shampoo. I needed a small shampoo because my big one doesn't have the attachments to it. So I just went ahead and bought this one. It was at Walmart. I got it for $78. Just as like a spot treatment um for like the furniture and stuff. So I got that. And I got this right here. 
to go with it. Pet carpet and upholstery cleaner. But that's it. I had fun yes. It felt good to get out the house yesterday and just try to get my mind off of what was going on. Thank y'all for everyone that's prayed and just reached out. Thank y'all so much. It means a lot. But that's it for this video. I hope y'all liked it. And make sure you stay tuned for the next one. Make sure you have your bell notifications turned on so you'll get notified when I upload my pantry video. I cannot wait to do this one. But that's it. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. I forgot to show y'all. I picked this up as well. It's just a shower cap from TJ Maxx, which I needed one. I don't currently have one. And it was only $2, so it's really soft. And it's cute.